Okay, what we're looking at today is a catfish pipe or a pipe trap. And basically what that is, it's a piece of a eight inch diameter sewer line. And I found this as a piece of scrap and I'm gonna show you how I turn it into a catfish trap that'll basically last forever. It, uh, it won't rust like a wire trap will, uh, it won't rot out like a wood trap will. And uh, as long as you're using scrap materials, it's uh, very cheap and very quick to make. Basically, this is about a four foot long section of uh, eight inch sewer pipe. And I've uh, got two plastic catfish trap throats. And you can buy these for five or six dollars uh, from a, a trap supply place or a fishing net company on the internet. But this is real simple to make. All you do, so this is the back end of the trap and you can see this is the plastic catfish throat. And all I've done is drilled a couple of holes in the sides of the pipe and then I've trimmed the throat so that it fits flush against the opening of the pipe. And then I've just zip tied it. And what this does is you allows you to slide the bait into the trap. I'm using uh, cheese, uh, cheese bait on this particular trap. And when the fish enters, he goes through the throat and then he can't come back out and he's trapped. To check the trap, uh, you simply pull it up. I've got a hole drilled in it that I'll uh, use my rope and attach my rope to it. But all you have to do is uh, cut the zip ties, empty the fish out, and then put the throat back in. You can zip tie it back in. I like zip ties because they're quick, um, they're cheap. You could use uh, twine, wire, what have you. But uh, the idea is you take the entire throat out to check the trap. Like I said, that's the back. Now the front of the trap, it's a little bit different. I've got it recessed in a little bit farther. Um, and I've also got it permanently wired in. Um, so this is real secure here. And uh, all you do is just drill a small hole in the uh, lip of the pipe. And that's what you put your rope um, or your clip through so that when you tie it off, you can retrieve it. And that's it, drop it in the water. So for about $10, I've got a four foot long catfish pipe trap that will never rust, never rot, never wear out. And if somebody happens to steal it, or if it gets washed away in a flood, or covered up, or something happens, I'm out 10 bucks. So anyway, that's uh, pretty much it.